Alright, well I'm back out of my farm today. Um, you see everything's starting to, to blossom out here. Alright, so uh, we'll see what happens. Um, I hit a new spot last time, uh, didn't really provide anything. So I'm gonna try with a different coil, try some different areas, and I'm swinging through some of the old stuff to get back there again. So hopefully I'll find something. Uh, I found a 64 penny on the way through, so um, we'll let you know. All right, let's go. All right, just dug my first decent find of the day. Uh, it's only about uh, three inches down, not very deep. Uh, it's a 1900 Indian head penny. Decent shape. I don't know if you can see it or not. Okay, see that? 1800. One cent. Alright, well, hopefully you can see that. Yeah, nice. First decent find in the morning. It's only been 10 minutes. So, we're off. Alright, just got my next interesting find. Looks like spoon ball. Yeah, it's just silver plated, so nothing too exciting. So, insert spoon toss here. Alright, got my next good find. Um, looks like I got another silver quarter out of this field. I've actually gotten about four different quarters in this one corner of this field before. And... Three of them have been barbers now, and one was uh, the seeded 1862 that I found last time I was here. But uh, in rough shape, but it is a 1914. I don't know if you can see that. Let's see if we can focus in there. Pretty scratched up, but uh, clean it up. What the hell? And the back, pretty beat up, but it's silver. Sweet. Second silver out of this field this year, basically in this corner of the field this year. Awesome, only a couple inches down. We're back at it. Haven't even got to the other section I'm headed towards yet, so. All right, Too bad. Pull out this hole, a couple inches down, probably two inches down. A watch, ladies' watch. Um, but I don't see any corrosion on here at all, so there's no markings on the back. So I gotta do some research on this one. As I don't know, I'm thinking that might be gold. It's kind of hard to tell what color that is. Maybe gold or silver. Maybe a light gold. Well, something there, but I think it's just dirt coming through the cracks. Um, yeah, it looks kind of old too. Um, I don't know. It's got a little heft to it. Inside is totally shut. Glass is gone. So I don't know. Maybe uh, someone in the jewelry industry, Nancy, uh, could uh, give me a heads up on this one. All right, nice. All right. Let's hit it. Keep going. Well, just found my next find. It's down here. Good. Oh, probably almost six inches down. And this one's a little different. This one you don't see every day. This one is a shot weedy penny. Yeah, believe me, it says we, it says one cent on the back. And poor Mr. Lincoln got shot in the head yet once again. Man, poor guy. I uh, can't read the year yet. Um, but uh, when I get home, I'll try and uh, figure out what that is. And All right. Well, there she is. In all her glory, one shot up wheat penny. Pretty neat. Uh, looks like a pretty good sized caliber bullet hit that thing. So whoever shot that was pretty damn good. Uh, I'd be guessing that was at least like a 9 mil, maybe a 40 cal or something. Pretty cool. All right. All right, all right. back to it. So we got rained out for the rest of the day. Uh, I can see out the window there, out the front. Uh, so, looks like I only got uh, four good hours, five hours total out in the fields. Um, good stuff, not a bad day. Uh, Would have liked to have done more, but unfortunately the weather wasn't cooperating. So, 
until next time hope everybody's finding some good stuff